how would you like to create Hollywood style B-roll videos for your videos using AI? Well, if you'd like to learn a little bit more about that, stick around to the end. How Henry now from Product Creation Formula. Here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks we to help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that sounds interesting to you, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. All right, guys, let's go check it out. Allow me to introduce you to Minimax. Now, this Minimax from Halo AI, I think it's Halo, I can't, I'm not sure if that is Halo or Halo or however it's pronounced. Anyhow, when you first sign in, this is what it's going to look like. Now, you do get the first three days for free. And the best part about that is it gives you unlimited. So I'm still within the first three days, even though I've purchased an upgrade. Let me show you the pricing before you get started. Okay, so they only have monthly at the moment. They don't have yearly, so that's coming soon. But right now, $9.99 a month for 1000 Credits per month, or you got unlimited, which is $94.99 a month. Let's go and have a quick look back at this over here again. Let's explore. Now I'm going to show you the ones I've created so you can get a rough idea as to what we're looking at. Now, this one here, I put down here a wizard who is a kung fu master battling a giant flying demon tiger in a forest. The kung fu master wins by shooting a blast out of its hands to the flying demon tiger. So this is what it came up with. And look how fast this guy's movements are. He shoots it directly at the tiger. That is brilliant, I love it. Now it does, it's not perfect. I had this one here. Humanoid robot serving dinner to a human family in a futuristic dining room. A beautiful futuristic home. Happy mother, father, son, and daughter takes the food that the humanoid robot prepared for them. Now. They haven't taken the food off him, which I was hoping that he would be passing it to one of them. But, and you don't have a daughter there. There's only mother, father, and son. No daughter. So that, that's a bit disappointing. It's a little bit, little bit off, but that's okay. You could probably still get away with that. Or just redo the prompt again. Then over here, I put down here, an AI brain floating in space. On the brain is a YouTube play button. I was kind of hoping that would be red, but that's okay. It still works out okay. And it does look like a YouTube play button. I'm thinking I could upload that into Pictory. And all these can go into Pictory or be used as B-roll in your videos, whether it be your course videos, whether it be your YouTube videos, or whatever type of videos you're creating. This can be used as B-roll. And even though they have the Minimax Halo AI here, when you download them, after you pay for them, it doesn't come up with that. If you're doing it for free, that will still be there. But if you are wanting to do it as a paid one, that is no longer an issue. Now look here, split screen on the left, a humanoid robot is typing on a laptop computer sitting at a desk on the right side of the screen. The same humanoid robot is holding a video camera and filming a businessman speaking to the camera. I'm sure you all understand what I just meant then. But unfortunately, it completely misinterpreted by putting the cameraman behind the camera instead of in front of. That is not quite what I was hoping for, but that's okay because it makes up for it a little bit later by creating this one. Split screen, and as you can see, he's now got a robot standing there. And I changed it around a little bit by changing the prompt just a little tiny bit. And then I had this one here, which was a little bit disappointing, a humanoid robot standing on the stage, holding a microphone. He is giving an inspirational talk to his human audience. Unfortunately, you don't see the audience. So in this case, I decided to get a bit more creative with this one. A humanoid, a robot standing on a stage, giving an inspirational talk to a large human audience. The camera pans around and you can see the gleeful audience gazing at the robot in awe and wonder. Have a look at this guy. It's kind of a bit weird uh, compared to all the rest. And then I wanted to make it that the money came out of the actual computer. Some of it came out of the computer screen, but others came out of the keyboard by the looks of it, or out, out from under his desk. So, hey, this is what it is. Let's now come up with a prompt that we can put straight in there and see what it comes up with. 
Okay, I decided to put a bit of a twist on this particular one here. A robot wizard who is a robot kung fu master battles a giant flying demon tiger in, in a forest. The robot kung fu master wins by shooting a blast out of his hands to the flying giant demon tiger is not a robot. Now, as you can see, it uses up 30 credits per video. So a thousand credits does not go a long way. So just be sparing with this. At the moment, I have infinite amount for the first three days. So go nuts on the first three days and make as many of these as you want on the first three days and then maybe slow down on the type of things you might want to create so that you don't go through too many credits. As, a, as you can see, it's 30 credits per video. And it's now created the video and I will pause the video because this does take about five minutes. It puts it in a queue and it can take quite a while to actually do it. It can be up to 10 minutes, depending on how many people are in the queue waiting. So I'll pause the video until it's finished. A lot of thing too, if you're a free member, you only get three in a queue at a time. If you're a paid member, you get up to five of these in a queue. So if you have five ideas that you want to create, you can actually have five of them in there waiting to be created. So as you can see, 75% of the way through right now. I just thought I'd show you that about how many can be queued up at the time. I'm not going to be doing too many in a queue at the same time because otherwise this video will be taking too long. I'll see you when we get back when it's finished. All right, so this one's now finished. Let's have a quick look at this. Oh yes, that's pretty good as well. Okay, there's a fire in the background and he's shooting out a flame to keep the demon tiger away. How good is that? That is so good. And it's kind of good that he's looking like a samurai. That is really cool. Okay. Now what I've also done was a sad human stands up from a desk and walks away. Meanwhile, a humanoid robot sits at the same desk to begin to work. Now, my thought process for this one was if I decided to ever create a video about AIs taking people's jobs. So this is where my thought pattern went with this particular prompt. A lot of these ones here are just fun. Like this one here is just for fun. This one here is for fun. But some of these other ones can be used as B-roll. Like for example, if I'm speaking about AI voiceovers, I can be putting this one in my, as B-roll. If I'm wanting to talk about making money online, this one could be used to show people making money online. If I'm talking about AI being used for YouTube, I could be using this as AI being used for YouTube. So my thought patterns are usually mostly to do with my work, but there are a couple that are for fun, like these ones here and this one here. These two are for fun and so is that one. So we'll wait for this one to finish and see what it comes up with. Okay, so I've just done a second one. A dragon is fighting a knight in a forest. The, the knight holds a shield and a sword and kills the dragon with one thrust of the sword. And I'm just going to hit that. Now I'm going to show you. It's going to put two in the queue once it gets started. We're still only 34% through the other one. Here we are. It's now got the second one in the queue. And as you can see, it's got two in the queue down here. And I could have up to five waiting in the queue at any given time. So that actually helps to speed the process up quite a bit. Once again, pausing the video until it's all finished. Hey, now this looks pretty interesting, actually. Let's have a look here. Uh, it, it matches almost identical to what I wanted. What I actually wanted was him to take over and sit down at the same seat. But having her walking past the robot who's working diligently makes sense as well. A sad human stands up from the desk and walks away. Meanwhile, a humanoid android sits at the same desk and it didn't put, didn't pay any attention to the word same desk to begin to work. So that's still not bad though. It interpreted it, but that's not bad. I, I, I would give that one a, a tick because that one is actually pretty close. And then the dragon one, which I put up next, you don't actually see him stab the dragon. That's quite Hollywood style. Have a look at that. That's really quite nice. I said Hollywood style videos, it would take a lot of special effects artists to be able to create something like that. And that's really cool. Especially with the fact that you can see the scales moving individually and the trees look real. Okay, he looks a little bit fake because of his face. But if you weren't looking at the face, 
So does the helmet and the shield and all that sort of stuff. It all looks fairly real. So it's pretty good. So this is Minimax from Halo. Or Halo from Minimax. I'm not sure which way it goes. So I'll leave a link for this in down below. And if you want to check it out, do so. It's not an affiliate link. So just jump in there, check it out if you want to. Okay, guys. If you got some value out of this video, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you can be notified when we upload more videos. Hey, while you're at it, want to consider sharing? Also, leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of Minimax from Halo or Halo from Minimax. I'm not really sure which one it is. All right. Now, also to let you know that right here is a video I believe you might like. Down here, there's a video YouTube thinks you might like. Here, well, that's an image of my head. And if you click on that, you'll be able to subscribe. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and bye for now.